Hey, I'm just Vosco and this is just Comic Book Tycoon. This is our first look at this game. I've just picked it up today. I've had a little play around with it, but I'm still um, figuring things out. So you'll have to bear with me, but let's jump right in. So we're going to go new player. Company name. Let's call it, I don't know. Um, oh, let's call it Box box full of kittens there we go why not that is our uh, comic book name uh, player name mr. Ross go there we go uh, we're gonna start with uh, let's go in the middle 100,000 um, artist writer Ooh, think I'm gonna be a writer What do these do? It doesn't tell me what they do. Okay, we're going to go writing. Um, drawing can be up. Stamina. Okay, so we've got these points to spend. I'm going to put writing up. Because we can hire an artist, I'd imagine. I'd imagine we can hire a writer as well, but I presume there's only going to be one writer per thing. Um, attitude. Do you know what? Let's get attitude up a little bit more. Do we think that's good? I think that's good. I'm going to go with it. Play. Uh, welcome to Comic Book Tycoon. Create critically acclaimed characters. Maybe one day someone will make movies on them first. Before creating comics, you have to create a new character. Uh, which we do down here. So we click on here and we go create a uh, character. So let's do that. Select different parameters of your character. The more complex character is, it needs better quality writer. But they receive good ratings from critiques. Okay, so we need a, a name. How about, let's go for a superhero, shall we? We'll start with a superhero and work from there. Although ninja is trending at the moment up here. I'm probably not going to go with a ninja. I'm going to call this Solar... Solar Man. Oh god, that's a terrible name. Solar... Solar Flight. That's what we call it. Um, you've reached your character limit. Ha I'm confused why the box is that big if that is my character limit. Okay, we're going to go for the age of uh, 30, 34. I think that's a good age. No, 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 no. We'll go for a young one. He can be young, so we're going to go... Do you know what? We'll go 16. Why not? Um, he's going to be a hero, and he is male. There we go. So those are both selected. Yes, excellent. Story complexity. I'm a good writer, so I reckon if we go 7... Uh, naive, yes, he is going to be superhero. Would that not fall under human as well? Human, superhero. I'm going to go sh superhero. We're going to aim this at children. Do we aim it at children or teen? What have we got? Teen male, teen female, adult male. Her. I'd imagine comic books originally were aimed at children, so we're going to do that. We're going to go action. Uh, more have we got here. Past story. I think his past story should be tragic. Or sad. Maybe sad. Maybe tragic's a bit much for children. Um, we're going to stick with action, because it is a superhero after all. Um, we're going to call him Miles... Miles Milton is Solar. Miles Milton is Solar. After the death of his father, he seeks revenge. Yeah, why not? He seeks revenge. But not okay i've reached character limit again apparently um even though the box is massive why can i not just use the whole box why would you give me a count a box that size and then go oh no you can't fill it up 
Anyway, um, he seeks revenge. There we go. We're going to stop there. I'll put a full stop because we can't apparently fill this entire box. Um, and we're going to go and create. There we go. Now I'm going to create another character because we need, for every hero, you need a bad guy. So create new character. Uh, we're going to call this character... Um... Ooh, what should we call him? Oh, I don't know. Eclipse. Um, we're going to go villain. We're going to go male. We're going to go age. 34. Because we were going to do that originally. So we'll go 34. He's male. He's a villain. Um, I'm going to go six again with him. Uh, he is going to be tough. He is a superhero. He has superpowers. So that's what he's not a hero, though. Super villain? Could that not be an option? Um, villain, okay, so that's fine. Children, action. Um, ambiguous. Let's go ambiguous. Um, not a lot. Oh, wait. Not a lot is known of Eclipse. Apart from his hate of solar. There we go. That works. So that is an enemy. Um, and let's go. His enemy is... Can I choose? Hello? Can I not choose an enemy? Create. Okay. Can we edit characters? Um, all characters... So we've got Solar. So if I edit him, you've reached character limit, and I go, where's my description gone? And I can't choose an enemy. What's the point in an M N N Oh, oh, Eclipse. There we go. Um, so we're going to tick that. That is his enemy. Okay, I've lost my description, apparently, so we're just going to go with that. Um, and if I edit character, wait, I can do this. All the characters, we've got Eclipse, so we're going to edit you. We're going to go enemy, solar, f solar flight. Wait, wasn't that the, the comic book name? No? Am I losing the plot? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Um, all characters. Did I not just call him Solar? No, I called him Solar Flight. Okay, fair enough. Um, I thought I was creating the comic, so I was going to call him Solar. Never mind, we can edit that. That is what we can do. We can go all characters. Um, edit character. Okay. We're going to call you... Solar, and then the comic's going to be called Solar Flight. Create. And now we can go... Uh, create comic. So we go here. Um, every story has five arcs. At the beginning of each arc, you can decide what areas you want to focus on. With every comic, you get limited hint uh, hit, hint points to use, them wi uh, to use them wisely. They highlight optimum... Regions for every arc. Ooh, that's interesting. Uh, so we've got um, Create comic is going to be called Solar flight um, What finished comic I presume that just means it's got an end into it. So it, there's no Continuing story. So we're going to say no to that single story. It's for children We are going to go action small. We are going to go superpower Surely that should be an option for the character, rather. This should be superhero for topic and then superpower for character. No? No? Am I wrong? I might be wrong. Uh, so you're the lead, and then we are going to add another character. So select character, and we're going to choose Eclipse. Uh, now we need to add an artist, which is me. I am the only one here. And we're going to add a writer, which again is me. I am the only one here. So if we create that... And we got hints. Okay, how do I use a hint then? 
Limited hint points are available. So I'm thinking that we've got pluses, minuses, and even. So I'm going to go story, 30. Dialogue, I think, doesn't need to be that high. We're going to go 15. And then world building, let's go 55. 55, 30, and 15. That is what I'm going with. Okay, so introduction. In the introduction, we want a bit of action. Or a lot of action, apparently. Um, can I use one of these? Oh, oh, I can. Look at that. Wait, there's five arcs, and I get three hints. Ah, so you need... If we can... Can I move any? No? Right, you're about there. So we're going to go right there with that. We're going to get a bit more comedy in there. Done. And then I should carry on writing that and adding points to story, characters, and art. We've got hype one, apparently. I'm not sure why, but we have. So does this renew with every comic? Because if that's the case, we could just use these, right? So if I do that, let's find out. So that's 63. 22. I might drop the dra- Oh, all decisions. I might go 19 there and 18 there. How about that? So we've got two left. So if we've only got two left on the next comic, um, we'll learn our mistake. If we have got... If they refresh on the next comic, um, that's great. I think we need a lot of action in the climax. We need a little bit of drama and a little bit of that. Can I get a bit more of that? Thank you. There we go. Let's get that going. After all, this is for children. So I'm imagining the drama doesn't have to be too high. Uh, we got story, characters, and art is doing okay up here. Um, well, what have we got? So we got full action. I don't know what any of this means, but um, let's go... A bit of that, tiny bit of drama, a bit more of that, and a bit more of that. We're just going to keep, or maybe a little bit less of that, and a bit more of that. How about that? Let's go with that. This is like, this is probably going to be a really bad comic book, I'd imagine, but it is my first one, so let's see what happens. Okay, so resolution. I'm going to say resolution is like a fight scene, is it? I don't know. We'll put a tiny bit of drama at the end, a bit of humour. Although that's got a minus figure there. Less of that. Even amount of that? Do we think? Oh, I don't know. Hmm, I'm going to go with that. We'll see what happens. So story is 57, characters is 40, and art's 49 at the moment. Um, I don't know how many more boxes are going to pop up. Do you want to give a contract to an external company for production? Yes, because I am in no place to do my own production. So we're going to go yes on that one. And I think 70 for story looks quite good. That has to be good. We definitely need to get um, artists and that in and create better characters. Uh, we've got a new record because we haven't done anything before. So let's find out what happens. I'm not liking this. Rank 145. Okay, so let's go. We're releasing it. And now, um, constantly developing storylines in the comic book drastically changed the world of comics in the 1980s. Oh, rank 14, unsatisfactory. Two star for my first one. I'm not too upset about that. Topic and genes, great. Story focus is great. Arc focus, terrible. Art quality is good. I'm quite happy with that. Writing is rubbish, considering I'm a writer. It's a bit annoying writing's rubbish. Characters is good and experience is awful. Okay, but we did get rank 14, so that's not bad. Uh, box full of kits. Kits. Box full of kit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Kittens didn't fit in. Box full of kit. Launched a new comic series on Solar, but the execution is sloppy. Well, it is my first comic, people. We've made a profit of £37,000 already on it. 53. Oh, so that's not bad then, is it? I feel we need to go to... Um, I might do a follow-up. Should we do a follow-up? We're, go we're going to create a new character. We'll have a villain. So we're going to call um, her... Let's go for her and we'll go Luna. And it's going to be a villain and a female. Age 24. Why not? 
Um, complexity, I think we should go six again. She is going to be fierce. Um, child action. Backstory. Mm, tragic. Let's go tragic. I would write a description, but apparently my descriptions disappear anyway, so I'm probably not going to do that. Um, ooh, love interest. We could give her a love interest. Maybe Luna is in love with Eclipse. Ooh, that would be good. And then she's got an enemy. So her enemy is Solar. No, not Eclipse. Solar. There we go. And create. Okay, and I'm going to create one more character, I think. Oh, no, no. Don't, don't overcomplicate things straight away. Uh, let's create the comic. Oh, no. Will it be a sequel? So if I go to all comics and I can go sequel, right? Yes, I can. Um, Solar Flight 2. I think we need a better name than that. Uh, Solar Revenge. There we go. Um, finished comic. No, it's for children. It's small action powered. Yeah, that's fine. Um, the lead is Solar. Uh, we're going to change that character, which is the enemy for Luna. And that's going to be the villain. And do you know what? I might add another character and when add it in eclipse as well and they're gonna be hmm they're gonna be villain as well so there's gonna be two villains in this episode uh we need to add an artist which again will be me and we need to add a writer which again will be me and let's create you can only add a maximum of four characters in this comic well i've only put in three so that's fine isn't it create okay so we want i'm gonna get this back up so it does refresh Ooh, that's interesting uh story i'm gonna go with 39 and then no let's get that down a bit and get dialogue up a little bit more that good yeah we're gonna go with that okay so let's get this one spot on so we need to go somewhere here i'm gonna say introduction action should be there drama and oh let's drop drama slightly and then get comedy up a bit humor and we're going to go next and then we're just going to wait for him to do his thing our sales are still going we got a profit of ninety-two thousand pounds i don't think that's bad personally i'm going to use this, this again so rise action so yeah lots of action in this one um some humor and a bit of drama how about that hmm that seems to work uh, the major economic shift which occurred between the early 1970s and mid-1980s led to a great rise of direct market distribution at the cost of a decline in the newsstand distribution. This huge shift for the better, uh, for the better greatly decreased uncertainty for the publishers. Okay, I'm learning as well as creating. Profit, £105,000. Wow. I'm going to keep using these hints. I think these hints are great. We want a lot of action in this one. Um, a little bit of comedy and a little bit of drama. There we go. So let's see how that does. Solar Flight is now off from the market. It sold 27,000 copies and generated 134 thousand in revenue profit was a hundred and eight thousand publisher nets 27 okay so we made a good chunk of money off our first one and i like the fact we got hype here hype is 17 um what's this this is uh the fall action so i'm i'm presuming action needs to be lower on this i may be wrong yes there we go look um a lot more comedy let's drop comedy a bit do you know what? Let's drop drama a bit and put comedy up a bit more. There we go. I say comedy, humour. I know what I mean. Put humour up. Hopefully we can do better on this. Hype is at 18, so hype's doing well. Um, now, what are we on? The resolution. I think we're going to go for about 43. 27. Um, oh, drama, drama, drama. Should we do that? Yeah, let's go with that. That's all over like a average, I reckon. 
Uh, it might be good, it might not. Our overall scores up here, 58-43, is looking much better than our last comic, so hopefully that's a good sign. Do you want to give your contract to an external company for production? Yes, I do. So he's going to finish off. 66, 52, and 50. I'm sure that smashed the last one. Almost positive it did. A uh, new record. Oh, only on the middle one, apparently. The other two are worse. Okay. So let's go next. Um, and we're going to wait for it to come in here. It came in at rank 14. It got three stars, which is better than the last one. And got not bad. I'm quite happy with that, in all fairness. Experience is rubbish, but I am a new a new person. And I've got two and a half stars down here. This is going well. Uh, publisher is hand in production. We've got profit of £37,000 already. Uh, recently, Boxful of Kit released a new issue of this comic. Um, new issue of this comic is not your ordinary comic. It has a great and deep message. Apparently, it has a great and deep message. £71,000 in our first day or month, month, I presume it is. Wow. I'm going to take that. We're going to add some new characters to the lineup. So, we've got an... I presume... Let's go for... Um, Laura... Laura what? Laura... Laura... Smith. Let's go Laura Smith. Um, she's going to be a hero. I say hero. Um, she's female. She is... Oh, I don't know. Let's say 15 as well. Maybe she's a school friend. Um, she's naive. She's a human. There we go. Her backstory is perfectly happy. She's in action and children. Why not? Her love interest is Solar. There we go. Look at that. And we're going to create. And she's going to be sort of like an extra an extra character. I would write a description, but I don't see the point if it's not going to save it. So I do want to create another character. So we're going to go new character. We're going to go for a villain. Um, and this bloke's going to be called... I don't know. Hive... Hive Mind. How about that? So let's go Hive Mind. We're going to put double zero because no one knows how old he is. He is male. Complexity... Ooh, I'm going to go seven, I think, on this one. Um, let's make him an alien. How about that? Yeah, we'll go alien. Um, action, his backstory, ambiguous. And his enemy is, of course, Solar. There we go. Lovely. Um, and we're going to create him, Bosch. So, now... If we go all characters, I presume I can edit him and then go enemy. And we can go Eclipse is his enemy, Lunar uh, and Hive Mind. There we go. Lovely. And his love interest is Laura. So enemy love interest. There we go. Excellent. And create. So now we can create another comic. I'm going to do another follow-up. So, all comics. We're going to... Oh, no. We should do a sequel to this one. So, we need to wait for this one to be over. Uh, we're at currently a profit of £145,000. That's quite impressive for my second one, as far as I'm concerned. I am very happy with that. At this rate, we'll be moving out of my bedroom and into a proper premises. Um, where we can actually hire some more people. A hundred and... Wow, we made £187,000 profit. And the publishers netted £47,000. That is fine. We can go with that. Um, what are those then? What are these? What's this? Ooh, company info, unlock topic and production. So we can look into that at some point. At the minute, I want to get my next comic book done. So let's go to all comics. No, nope, that's all characters. Let's pick the right button. All comics. We've got 
Solar's Revenge. So let's go for a sequel. Uh, solar... Solar what? Solar... Oh, I don't know. Solar... Oh, solar, solar. Why not? <laughs> um, it's not going to finish. It's going to be for children. It's action, small, and superpower. Um, we are going to go... Who have we got? So we've got Solar as the lead. We've got a new villain, which is Hive Mind. And that is the villain. Ooh, I'm not going to kill anyone off yet. Uh, select character. So we want to put in Hive Mind. We're going to put in Laura Smith. And she is the love interest. There we go. So we got those set up. We need an artist, which again is me. And we need a writer, which is me. There we go. And we are going to create. So Solar Solar. You can only have that. That's fine. I don't know why it keeps telling me that. Um, okay, so we want... This is quite high. I'm going to go about 67. We're going to go 16 there. Uh, no, we're not. We're going to go 10 there. Because let's be fair, the dialogue doesn't have to be great. I might drop you slightly and just bring you up. There we go. Um, okay, so what's this? The introduction. We're going to use one of these just so we can gauge what we need. I'm going to try and aim in the middle of these. Yeah, there we go. We're going to go with that one. And he's going to get to work. My bed looks awfully shiny. Look at those pillows. They're very shiny pillows. And I've just noticed... Wait, so this is Rise action. So we're going to go for... I reckon we're going to go for about 70%. We're going to put Drama at 12%. No, we're going to put Drama at 10% and then 20% on that. I've just noticed whatever this is on the bed is floating. There is a shadow underneath it. Why is it flo What is it? I don't know. I don't have much in my room, in all fairness. This one, we're going to go really high. So 85%. 3% on drama. 12% on tumor. So we're sort of building a name for ourselves in the superhero market. We only have one superhero at the moment, but we can, we can work on that. Um, right, so let's click this one and see what we've got. So humor's up there, that's up there, and that's there. There we go. We've got a hype of 24, which is going up, and it is higher than last time, if I remember correctly. And um, what have we got? We might as well use these hints, because they are there. We can put you there, and you there. There we go. Now, if you've enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button. And if you haven't done already, please subscribe. It does help the channel. If you want to check this game out, get over to Steam and have a look. And if you want to know how I get on with this new comic, join me on the next episode. And until then, I'll see you again.